We are here with electoral officer for the by-election 2019 coming up in February, uh, Mr. Angus Montour. Angus, welcome. Okay, thank you. Uh, our first question, I guess, will be how did you become electoral officer again? Because we know in the summertime with a major election that the electoral officer has to be elected. But this time is different. Why is that? Well, from from what I figure, the 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 MCK and um, election group figured that since I was still uh, electoral officer within a year, uh, instead of going through the entire process over, they first requested if I would be interested, uh, and in order to gauge it, they would make a decision then. So. Seeing that I did accept, uh, it, it it saved like a month's worth of uh, reprocessing and uh, redoing everything. So, and your your assistant um, electoral officer is once again Muriel White Rice. Yes, that's correct. Okay. Uh, let's talk about the timeline. In the summer, you've got at least two or maybe three months time to to run the whole election and get all the dates in. And uh, it's a lot quicker this time around. Yes, uh, in in the summertime, the process runs over approximately four months, and here we're we're under two months. So everything, the election process is basically the same, but it's now totally condensed. So all the preparations and all uh, everything else is done so quickly, and uh, you know. Uh, fortunately, it it is still fresh on our minds. It's only been uh, six and a half uh, months, so we basically can use all the stuff, but we have to rewrite some of it, and there's still a lot of groundwork to do, but it has to be done much quicker. So we're in that process now. So. All right, let's talk about the process itself and the dates that have been set. Uh, How is it going to unfold? Okay, we, we are having a uh, nomination day on... Um, on February 9th, which would be held at the services complex between 10 and 12. The entire process is going to remain the same as it was before, except that on the posters I requested that uh, all the nominees, nominators, seconders to please uh, sign all your papers as a trio in order to expedite the process. And uh, by doing that, you're going to not only help yourself, but you'll help us to prepare with this uh, in, in, in our very quick timeline. The uh, What's next after that is uh, going to be the, the, the advanced poll. Um, we are asking anybody who's interested to vote in the advanced poll to have their letters written to myself and submitted uh, by... February 11th at noon. Right. And, uh, and the advance poll takes place? It's going, to, it's going to take place on the 16th between 10 and 12 uh, at the Golden Age Club. And that's Saturday, yes. Okay. Then, then after, that? after that, we have the Meet the Candidates Night, which will be held on um, Wednesday, February 20th, at, starting at 7 o'clock. And it'll be at the Golden Agers Club as well. And then the big day. They, we have the, the big election that we held at Gornyanu School again. The, the regular hours between 9 and 6 o'clock. And that is on Saturday? On Saturday, uh, uh, February 23rd. 